If you've been experiencing sudden FPS drops while gaming, and you happen to use the NVIDIA app on your PC, there's a good chance that some background settings could be causing performance issues. In this video, we'll walk through a few important steps that might help you stabilize your frame rate and reduce stutters, all without having to download any shady tools or mess with risky configurations. Everything we're going to do is safe, built into Windows or NVIDIA's own utilities and can be reversed easily if needed. To begin, we're going to adjust a setting inside the NVIDIA control panel, head to your desktop and right click anywhere on the empty background. In the context menu, select show more options and then click on NVIDIA control panel. If it doesn't appear there, don't worry. You can also open the start menu, type NVIDIA control panel, and launch it from the search results. Once the control panel is open, look to the left-hand side and select manage 3D settings. Then make sure you're on the global settings tab. Scroll down until you locate the setting called shader cache size. Click the drop-down menu and select disabled. After that, hit the apply button in the bottom right corner to confirm the change. Disabling the shader cache may help eliminate stuttering or inconsistent performance caused by old cache data clashing with new game builds or updated GPU drivers. Once you've applied that change, go ahead and restart your computer to make sure everything is properly saved. After the reboot, open up the official NVIDIA app by searching for NVIDIA in your start menu. When the app launches, look to the left-hand side and select the Drivers tab. Here you'll find an option to choose between two different driver types, the Game Ready Driver, also known as GRD, and the Studio Driver, or SD. If you mainly use your PC for gaming, go with the Game Ready Driver. It's optimized for performance and compatibility with the latest titles. Select it, then hit the download button. Once the download finishes, follow the on-screen instructions to install the updated driver. These updates often include important performance boosts and bug fixes that can significantly improve your experience, especially with newer games. Next, it's time to clean up your system's cache files. Go to your start menu again and type in disk cleanup. Launch the disk cleanup utility and once it opens, click the Clean Up System Files button. After a moment, the list will refresh and show additional options. Scroll down and make sure DirectX Shader Cache is checked. You can also check other categories if you want to clear up more space, but for this step, the Shader Cache is the most important. Click OK and then Delete Files when prompted. This will remove outdated cache data that can sometimes conflict with newer drivers and cause frame drops or input lag during gameplay. After cleaning the cache, we'll now re-enable the shader cache, but this time we'll allow the driver to manage it by default. Reopen the NVIDIA control panel and once again go into the Manage 3D Settings or Write section. Find the Shader Cache Size option again, and this time select Driver Default from the drop-down. Click Apply to save your changes. This setting allows NVIDIA's driver to handle caching automatically, which is usually the most balanced option for long-term performance and stability. To wrap everything up, restart your PC one final time. This will ensure that all changes, including the new driver, cache settings, and cleanup steps, are properly applied. After your system boots back up, launch your game and see if performance has improved. Many users report noticeable boosts in FPS and smoother gameplay after following these steps. If you found this guide helpful, or if you run into any issues along the way, feel free to leave a comment below. I'll do my best to help you out 
And if you'd like to see more optimization videos like this, don't forget to like the video and subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.